Guys, I want to um, wish you all a happy Thanksgiving. We're rolling into Thanksgiving. And I do want to mention to you that um, I won't be doing the podcast Thursday through Sunday. I don't do it on the weekend anyway. But I'll be back uh, in the saddle uh, next Monday. So looking forward to that. I hope you have a great weekend. Uh, I'd like to say just a word about Thanksgiving. We do have, despite all our political uh, woes, a lot uh, to be thankful for. And as I think about Thanksgiving, I'm thinking not so much about the pilgrims and the Indians. I'm thinking really just more about the uh, how much fun it is to live in America, just the kind of dynamism of American life. You know, yesterday I had... Um, the uh, Harvard scholar Ruth Weiss on the podcast, and we were talking about Jewish uh, literature. And I don't know if it came up, but one of the novels that she uh, talks about and teaches is a novel by Saul Bellow, the Nobel laureate. It's called Herzog. And, um, and I want to just read the first line of that novel because to me it, uh, it kind of captures uh, what I'm talking about about America, it's, it's kind of a crazy line. If I'm out of my mind, it's all right with me, thought Moses Herzog. Now, let's think about this for a minute. First of all, just the way the line is written, right? It's not Moses Herzog thought. It, the line, it, you get his thought first before you are introduced to him. So you're forced to participate in the thought. In fact, for a moment, you think it's the author speaking. If I'm out of my mind, there are no quote marks, it's all right with me. Now, what is Herzog really saying here? He's saying, in effect, that if people think I'm crazy, uh, but not just if they think if I'm crazy, if I'm a little crazy, it's all right with me. <laughs> and um, obviously, Herzog isn't crazy in the normal sense. He's not somebody who needs to be in an asylum. But what he really means is that he's out there. He lives a highly experimental life. He is constantly, it turns out, getting into trouble, getting himself out of trouble. But what's... Kind of like <laughs> Debbie says, I can see why you identify with this guy. <laughs> Dinesh says, if it's all out of his mind, it's all right with Dinesh. <laughs> if people hate him, it's all right with Dinesh. In fact, he likes it. He wonders how he can get them to hate him more. <laughs> How can he aggravate them even further? See, exactly. Now, with Herzog, what, what's striking about this line, and I'll, I'll close on this, is it's the self-consciousness of Herzog. Uh, that's why it's important, thought Moses Herzog. These, he's aware uh, of the way that he appears in public space, and he's also aware that he's breaking the mold. And that, in some ways, is the American way. It's not conformity. It's not hierarchy. It is breaking the mold. And in this sense, we get to live lives that are, in a way, more interesting, more unique. American lives differ more from one another than, say, lives of people in India or in other countries. So let's give thanks for all the blessings we have.